Hey everybody, here's a preview video for this week's auction. Neat uh, lot of St. Joe material from the armor plant that I think it like blew up way back when in the 30s or something like that. Bond can tell you all about it. He's not doing the video this week. I know you guys are going to be disappointed. But, um, then over here, there are um, a lot of different pieces of headgear from different, different countries. Visor caps. Nice additions to your collection. Stuff you don't see every day. There are some... Uh, okay. Some jackets. Looks like maybe British, US. West German, East German. Uh, let's see where, let's go around this way. This is cool watchmake, watchmaker's cabinet. So this is, has like lenses and pins and all sorts of different watchmaking stuff. And then so you put the you put the watch in there and then put that down. Somehow put the lens back on. Pretty cool. Neat metal cabinet. And a lot of jewelry. Some ephemera and some porcelain. These are really cool photos of different signs and automotive stuff. Oh, pretty, look at that, that's pretty cool. There's some other stuff in that box too. Some glasses, like designer glasses, sunglasses and stuff. More jewelry, boxes of jewelry. more, some coins, some old banks, some old toys, more banks, um, then more jewelry, like that's a sterling coro brooch, um, some various things in there, I'm not sure if this little inkwell or whatever is silver, it seems like it tested okay, but it's marked weird. Then all these little boxes of brooches are kind of hard to see through this glass, no, but there's some really good stuff in there. Some Weiss and Sarah Coventry and things like that. Then um, some jewelry there. Looks like we have some red lines. Some powder horns. Huh, that's crazy. Hardware. Antique shotgun parts, miscellaneous ammo. Again, if you're buying ammo from here or anything, it's you know, really, especially like that, just a collector. Um, some leather briefcases. That guy. I don't know if any, I don't know offhand. Uh, some state quarters. More jewelry. This is a really cool book by this guy Cecil Griffith, who like pretty much ran the Missouri River way back when. Real character of a guy, but it goes all the way down the river, telling different uh, different spots. I actually uh, one time a long time ago put with two of my friends we put a canoe into where the river meets Grand Street. <laughs> and went down the Missouri River for two days. <laughs> but anyway, we had a copy of that book with us. And it was really cool. Here's an Alexa, or whatever it works. Necklaces, pen, this thing here. Curta calculator. Look that up. Look that up. That is... What's happening here? I'm not sure. Okay. Some pens, and we've got some toys, and 
other stuff. This isn't a uh, There's a ton of stuff in this week's auction. This area here. Turn it off for me. Please and thank you. Um, there is a guitar, classical guitar, there's a school bell, or whatever kind of place you need to cast iron bell. Um, looks like some vintage Hyrax. That's a cool RCA mid-century radio. Fire truck, concertina, egg box, cigar molds, some more jewelry. Oof. Purses. There's a Sansui 2000X. Seems to be just fine. So not a lot of stuff up here. Typewriter. Is this not from last week? Is this a different one? No, they made a whole bunch of those. Hmm. 48 star flag. They're so one funny. Of the only one. Alright. Um, then there's uh, a lot of neat old toys. Stuff? Oh, we can we can do this one here. 1932 original GOP poster. Pretty cool. Oh, we'll get back to that. Some uh, 
pretty cool stuff over here. Decorators, neat old Tonka, uh, Velvet Bullfighter. Got one Paris area. Some neat uh, tubes there, a whole box of tubes. Some modern art pieces. Wagon wheel hub lamp. 1890s cell phone replicas. Um, this is like a bunch of film stuff. There's like Kansas and Western stuff over here. Gun books, stuff. Um, Kansas City stuff, local history stuff, record guides. This is a really cool typewriter with uh, Russian and Russian Cyrillic letters. And over here, um, there's some aliens magazines and some steins and some eagles. Um, where do you want to go now? Over here. Looks like some speakers and some records. Neat little four-door metal cabinet. Looks look like there's some good stuff in there. Should do well. More records, mineral specimens, fossils and such. Um, marbles. toys and stuff over here I know we have a lot of good toy buyers More neat old banks and character glasses and old toys and train stuff. More toys. And more pretty cool sports stuff. Slot car stuff, banks, that's really cool. Nice groups of stuff over here. <coughs> uh oh, looks like there's some jarts. What? Or are they not? Nope, model rockets, sorry. You, you don't know what jarts are, do you? Mm -mm. It's probably for the best, they're very dangerous. Is it like darts? It's like darts. They're like lawn darts from the 60s and 70s you throw them up in the air but they have these spikes on them and I guess they were <laughs> nailing each other with them so <laughs> they supposedly became illegal you ever played beer darts I don't know have I <laughs> I don't know I don't think so pretty fine Is that where you throw full cans of beer at people? No, you throw the darts at the can and then you drink it. Oh. Hmm. Makes a lot of sense. That was my next guess. Really? Cool stuff in here. OK, 
contents. Big boxes of toys, McDonald's stuff, collectible, resellable things over here. Cool. Okay, now we can go over here. Are you still rolling? Yeah. Okay. I don't know, sometimes you stop them. Sometimes. And then we'll do these shelves over here. We're, I bet we're out of here by 10 o'clock this week, folks. I hope I'm jinxing myself because the longer the auction, generally, the more money we make for our consigners. And. Oh, there's going to be a few really high dollar things here. A lot of really good deals. It's always funny to see what you think is going to bring a lot of money and then what does and does not. And it can change from one night to an, to the next. Now you want to do this table? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we've been going over and doing this table after the shelves. And that's the way we're going to keep doing it. So some new clocks. More toys. Here is uh, Kaufman Stadium and Camaro Head, signed and numbered. And this box has some cool stuff in it. Like there's old like World War One era postcard. Woodrow Wilson. These new eight, late 1800s insurance papers. I like stuff like that. Some more train stuff. I don't think there's anything in there. Not really. Some nice bookends. This should be up front. Here's a surface. Um, I don't know what kind of condition or working or all that. I guess this came with Windows 7 HP Pavilion G series. Looks clean. Some crockery and more. And then we'll go over here. Let's see, I think people are still picking that stuff up. So there's not going to be a lot over here. Got the cedar chest. Um, then some packing boxes, kiln, uh, is that like a malt machine, old scale, a uh, bed with frame, looks like queen size bed with frame, um, and let's go finish this okay. with the same person, so some interesting artwork here. Not a ton of stuff down here. Looks like there's a Wii pretty complete with little games and all sorts of stuff. These guys? Um, some rugs. Then we'll go back here probably. And there's more records. Hey, another iron butterfly. What are the chances of that? <laughs> There's going to be some good stuff back here. Okay, a little stereo. Some artwork. That's, this is a nice, really nice mirror here, kind of hidden back here. Neat old piece. Fishing stuff and more toys. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, yeah, sparsely laid out stuff. Wait a minute. More toy, more toy cars.
more toys. A little bit of furniture, some primitive primitive farm stuff here too. Folks, don't just because you see this here doesn't mean that you need to go bring in a bunch of stuff like this. This is a liquidation, um, and so just because you see the stuff on here doesn't mean that it makes sense for you to bring it on here, bring it down here. It's like a set of China Noritake. glasses I can tell you what kind um, some dolls <laughs> Nortaki G R A M A T A N so there you are through all this stuff here but uh looks like it's gonna be a pretty neat auction so I guess Juan said there's these two items and all the rest of these are all right we'll see when we get we'll see when we get to it Wizard of Oz stuff. Some glass, some porcelain, some china. There's going to be some more records over here. 